Breaking news out of South Bend, Indiana, Michael Shrewsbury has been hired as Notre Dame's newest head basketball coach, was with Penn State the last two seasons, and is now set to take the HC job with Notre Dame. This news was first reported by ESPN, 46 years old, a Shrewsbury, an Indianapolis native, just guided the Nittany Lions, of course, to their first NCAA tournament appearance since 2011 after making a Cinderella run in the conference tournament for the Big Ten there as well. Losing to Purdue in that game, but that getting them to the tournament, and then, of course, a little Cinderella run in the tournament there as well. They won their first round game over Texas A&M and looked good in the tournament against Texas as well. This hiring now ends a search that began on January the 19th when Notre Dame announced Mike Bray would step down at the conclusion of the season, a 23-year 23, a 23 run for Bray. Uh, he went 483-280 and 280 as the Irish's head coach and left the program, of course, as the all-time wins leader for Notre Dame. This past season, 11-18, uh, 3-17 and 17 in the ACC in his final season. But a historic run for Mike Bray at Notre Dame. He reached 23 NCAA tournaments, Big shoes now to fill for Shrewsbury with the Fighting Irish. This is a great hire, though, guys. Deep Indianapolis roots, two step, two separate stints at Purdue, and now at, at Penn State as well. A lot of experience in the Big Ten, around this region, in the country. And what a flip for the Nittany Lions after going 14 and 17 in the first season, 23 and 13, 500 in the Big Ten, and then the two runs there to close out the season as well. Shrewsbury going to be inheriting a Notre Dame roster with just five scholarship players heading into the next season, excluding unlikely to return grad student Cormac Ryan. The Irish had four other grad students exhaust their eligibility after this year. Three players entered the portal on the first day it opened. Among the five scholarship players, though, that he will inherit, that will include Mishawaka out of Indianapolis, as well as Marcus Burton. Georgetown reportedly in the mix for Shrewsbury and was one of the leading candidates as well, but they hired Ed Cooley on Monday, and that allowed Shrewsbury to end up in South Bend with Notre Dame as he will now be taking over for Mike Bray. For more on this and all things surrounding Notre Dame basketball, Notre Dame football, and everything going on in the world of Notre Dame athletics, be sure to check us out at blueandgold.com. Don't forget, guys, hit the like button on this video, subscribe to our YouTube channel, and get in the comment section. Let me know what you think about this hire and what Notre Dame basketball is going to look like under the reign of Micah Shrewsbury. For BlueAndGold.com, my name is Trey Anity. Notre Dame has hired its newest head basketball coach.